This episode begins with Lee and breaks down and asks his brother to believe him, but he asks in return to gain trust. Lian must kill himself by taking the blame for being the spy. Lian requests his brother, the king, to kill him but before he can, the king pukes blood and collapses. They learn that the herbal medicine has been poisoned. Before the physician could arrive, the king dies leaving his last words where he states that Lian must find the one who poisoned him and ascend the prince royal to the throne. When the news of the king's death passes, the minister of war, Chong Bai returns with wrath in his eyes. He asks whether the king left his last words and Li In says yes, before changing the whole story and stating the king wanted him to ascend the throne and protect the nation. Chong Bai doesn't believe in Li Rn's words and asks for a witness. Just then the court lady comes and becomes the witness. We see in the flashback that Lian requested her to say the same. Likewise, the physician also says that the king died of illness, and it's not a murder. Lian tells the ministers that he has no intention to become the king, and that even if one minister opposes, he'll back off. He clearly has a plan and knows Zhong Bai is the only one who will oppose him. Zhong Bai fights to get a confession from the Bodu player Mong Wu. He sues stating the spy was sent by Lian. He sends Hai and Bo, his right hand to carry the duty. However, Mianha, who knows that Mongwu is Hisu, demands he interrogates. During the interrogation, he requests Hisu to blame Lian, but she doesn't abide by his ways. The next day, Chong Bai brings evidence showing the confession of the Bodu player and requests the arrest of Lian. However, Lian says that he has a witness to tell that the confession is a forgery. The witness is none other than Haimbo. He betrays Zhongbai and sides with Lian. This results in Zhongbei's execution in front of his son Myungha. We then learn that Lian bought Haimbo by agreeing to punish Mongwu, Hisu, and the comfort woman. Lee in orders that the criminals endure severe punishment. Mong Wu. Hisu pleads to Lee in to spare her friend, the comfort woman, stating that's his. Her wish for the promise they made. However, Lee in acts coldly and says that he is no longer a normal man to offer the wish. This leads to the captives to endure the punishment, which results in the comfort woman's death. Mongwu. Hisu escapes from the soldiers and promises herself as she will return to avenge the death of her friend and make Lian suffer. Meanwhile, Lian orders the wife of his brother, the queen, to leave for the temple and become a monk if she wants her son Prince Royal alive. She pleads with Lian to spare her nephew Myungha as well, and he accepts. He transfers Myungha to a dire town and he promises himself that he will also return and take his revenge on Lian. Three years later, we see that the people are living happily. Under the king's order, the palace announces a public notice for a strong Bodhuk player to play with the king. We see Mongwu, Hisu coming back after many years to join the contest and finally meet Lian. The Manji hates 